Hey guys, this is Jwanti. I'm back with a news video in regards to the PlayStation PC launcher. Now, as you probably have noticed or you probably have heard about the news that Spider-Man came back on PC for the first time. And um, the data miners, they always check the files and everything. So, somebody was checking the files and uh, what they found was that there are some signals in the coding uh, about a PC launcher that might actually come in the future for PlayStation PC so uh, that's probably in the uh, plans for PlayStation as well maybe they want to do something like Ubisoft or Rockstar and launch their games using their own launcher which is not actually a bad idea so references to a PlayStation PC launcher have been found within the files of Marvel Spider-Man Remastered which launched on PC last week suggesting that such a platform could be in Sony's future plans. I think this is a good idea so they could uh, make their games visible or playable on PC as well but they will have still some kind of control on the games where it can only be launched using their launcher so they will have more control over the games as well. I think this is one of the good things. Maybe they can put up an emulator for uh, PlayStation as well on the PC which is going to be legit and people can actually go ahead and buy the games that's going to be like a PSN, PlayStation, whatever so PC <laughs> I think that's going to be a good idea if they can do it so this all the discovery that Sony could be planning to introduce PlayStation Network integration to its PC games as well while neither Marvel, Spider-Man nor any other PlayStation Studios PC game currently allows connectivity with the PSN accounts Spider-Man's files contain multiple references of PSN account linked and PSN linking entitlement. So this is actually very good news. I'm, I'm liking it. A lot of people are going to be encouraged to get this launcher if it comes up and they would like to play the PlayStation games as well which have been exclusive to PSN only. So that's where all of Sony's PC games have been released on Steam and the Epic Games Store while PlayStation has a PlayStation PC brand it is generally used as a collective term for all the PC releases rather than a launcher so I think this is very good news I'm gonna put a link in the description as well for this article where you can actually go ahead and read it completely if you want to with that John TM signing out you have a nice day thank you for listening and watching